Happy New Year, Frontier. We have a fun invitation for the whole church as we delve into new kids ministry realities at the start of this year. Yes, Happy New Year, and we have a new year. We have a fresh team. We're so excited to welcome Dot. Dot, we welcome you onto our kids ministry team, yep. and we have fresh vision and a fresh need. What we are inviting you into is to partake, join up, link up with our kids ministry this year. We've got a huge need with growing kids, and we, we really are looking for 10, at least 10 new folks to join our kids ministry um, volunteer team because... We are determined that this is going to be fun, strengthening, and, and super life-giving for everyone involved. We don't want anyone to be serving like kind of alone in a classroom. We want it to be fun with teams and multiple people in each classroom. So in order to not burn out our, our current team, we are inviting um, the whole church just to consider even an initial three months to start the year. If you've never done kids ministry, all we need is for you to not have a criminal record, for you to love Jesus, and to be willing to learn. And we have multiple kinds of roles. You're not going to necessarily be teaching at all if you're not comfortable with that. So uh, if you are at all interested, we simply invite you to, to contact Sue. She can give you more information. Even contacting her is not a commitment. It's just to kind of get some information to, to be able to help out. And some of you may go, you know what? I can't commit to this, but I can help out for the next few months because I see the need and I love the family. And that would be amazing for us to kind of uh, cross the divide into the new year with, uh, with, our, with our new uh, blossoming bunch of little ones that we want to serve and do a really good job. The testimonies of what's happening with these kids just in the brief kind of hour that we have on Sunday morning is unbelievable. It's incredible. And, and the just... kids, are, if you want to find where the life is happening in the local church, find a child. Because yeah. hearing them hear from God, it wrecks you. I was in youth ministry, for example, testimony on Sunday, three different kids in three separate ways when we went into our little prayer cave to say, how are you hearing from God? They actually were like, God's speaking into my worth. He wants to know how much he loves me and into my worth that I've been doubting myself and he's speaking a different word. And I'm like, can you speak that to me? I need that testimony. God is alive and active in us, yes, but in our children and we want you to be a part of it. So we're inviting you in. Just contact Sue if you want any of that information. We love you and we'll see you Sunday. Bye.